Who's that? Who's out there? Someone over there? No, I'm serious. I heard something over there. Put that cat down. I heard something over there. I don't know what it was. Hello? Oh, careful, dude. Oh, shit. You can't be doing occult stuff like this. Do it's a what you're doing. You're fucking crazy. Hold on. We heard some spooky movement over here. Who's over here? Take your cloak off. You stand a 99% chance of killing your daughter if you try to outsmart us. Follow our instructions, and you stand a 100% chance of getting her back. Fucking mathematician over here. I know, this guy is a smug piece I've of crunched shit. the numbers. <laughs> I've run the permutations through my little computer, and all of them say, you're fucked. My murder laptop. <laughs> my murder laptop. Hat, dump a boy. People dump things in lots. Yeah. There's a boy in a box in a lot. Also, not always intentionally. You lose a hat in a lot. Oh, I'm pretty sure the boy in the box was dumped there intentionally. It was probably intentional. No one's like dragging a boy in the box and then like, as they get home, they're like, I'm forgetting something. Janet, we left the, <laughs> we left the box. <laughs> Our boy was in that box. Esther saw two figures in the bedroom, but could not identify them as they fled the scene. By the way, two figures. Razor boy. Oh my God, no. He's back. <laughs> no, we're not calling that. He's back from boarding school. <laughs> It does. It does look like a spooky fun house. I think we'll have fun in there? No. I think we'll have fun. Well, you think we're gonna have fun everywhere. You could go into a building that's on fire and you'd be like, this is a blast. I would not say that. Donnie Depp reportedly spent $350,000 outbidding Arnold Schwarzenegger to become Fox's co-owner and a majority stakeholder in the company controlling the bar. <sighs> Do you imagine Schwarzenegger with that paddle? 100,000. <laughs> 150,000. Not this time, Depp. Put that paddle down now. There it is. Put it down, it's my bar. 350,000. You know? I'm a pirate. <laughs> Move one of these things off of, uh, off of these, I don't know, what, what would you call this? Um, hanging, do, hanging do, do those have words? Hanging receptacle? Yeah. There's gotta be a better word for it than that. That's not our fault. What about this grow a girlfriend? Is it just like an add water situation? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I don't think it grows into it. Well, they also have grow a boyfriend. And a therapist. And a this is a dark section of this gift shop. Yeah. Meanwhile. Also felt she was not a victim of mass hysteria. The whole idea of hysteria is that you don't realize it. You're not like, yeah, we all participated in a mass hysteria. It was a, it was a real riot. I was, <laughs> Gorchinsky was, man, she got fucked up. <laughs> she was having a great time. What a fun hysteria that was. You know, it's not like a flash mob? No, it's not a flash mob. <laughs> okay known as the Great Plague of London. The disease ultimately claimed as many as 100,000 lives, roughly a fifth of London's population. What a chunk. I mean, this was what no a, joke. What a chunk. There's a reason why they called it the Great Plague. Oh, this is great, man. No, I, You should have been there for that plague. <laughs> no, it wasn't like that. ass. That thing was a hell of a plague. Yeah, I T-voted. I don't have any family left. He traveled all the way to Arizona and Texas for leads. Bristow even consulted with a psychic who held staples from the bassinet box, hoping he or she could gather some clues. Bristow went even as far as carrying a mask of the boy's face in his briefcase. Okay, <laughs> let's think about some things here. The, the he, last two went a little off the edge. Yeah. Especially um, the latter. That doesn't even seem helpful. So would he wear it and go to people and be like, you, you do, do you know me? <laughs> Do you see my little boy face? Does this look familiar to you? Wow. You know what's even weirder? Even if he didn't open with that and he's like interrogating someone like, you seen this kid? No, no. All right, let me pull out one more thing. <laughs> clip, clip, clip. Now. <clears throat> now have you seen him? And they're just like, no. Could you please leave Can my home? please leave? <laughs> Emma Marie told Augustine that she did have a boy who passed away in bizarre fashion with morgue records supporting her statement. His cause of death was electrocution from a nickel ride outside of a store, once again leading to a dead end. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Do you think she was like, hey, here's a nickel, Timmy. I'm gonna go inside and get some groceries. I'll be right back. Or the more horrifying version of that. Do you think she made him ride the ride and sat there and watched as he was apparently having too much fun and got really excited if and was like, like, yeah! <laughs> and then- You think he screamed like R2D2? <laughs> <laughs> See, that's kind of horrifying when you think about that Sure one. is. But there was a moment where she was probably like, wow, he's really enjoying that ride. Yeah, it's just one of those unfortunate deaths where obviously it's a tragedy, but boy oh boy, is that a laugh riot. <laughs> 
said that Owen kept the shades tightly drawn and the lights off, with the exception of one dim lamp. Other staff members who entered the room also mentioned this detail. I don't want to be in the room when they're in there. That's scary. Yeah. So I imagine him just sitting in a chair in the corner, just, just sh a shadow man. Clean it. Clean the room. You, I think you're getting Anton Chigurh vibes from this guy. Fluff the pillow. <laughs> maid, Mary Soapdick. <laughs> What's her name? Oh God, I know what you're, she's a maid, her name is Soapdick. I'm ha, trying ha, to move back. What a really funny big laugh you got out of that. Look how, yeah, look how happy you are. Oh man, so what a dick. gem of comedy we've mined here today. <laughs> I've connected the two dots. You didn't connect shit, but. I've connected them. Ready? Firing. Anything behind me? Dude, there's no fucking head on you. What? <laughs> <laughs> I would have been into that. Why are you on this bridge? You ask questions. Why are you on this bridge? <laughs> <laughs> you better watch out, a Yankee Jim will give you some taffy. Some folks say they hear him playing a jolly little kazoo tune in the middle of the night. <laughs> someone running through the forest covered in blood, you're not gonna bat an eye. You'll probably just be like, oh, as you were. That's not how the forest works. Fuck you, goat man. Holy shit, Is dude. that good? Don't try to paint me as a... I'll paint you however I want. Don't you, what? I'll paint the hell out of you however I want. You paint me in your free time? Yeah. <laughs> They're good. Oh, you, Jesus. You wanna see them? No, yeah, never. Third ghost is the spirit of a little girl who is seen in different spots throughout the second floor. The fourth ghost. That's all we got on her? Yeah, that's it. She's. <laughs> 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 right, I think we, we solved it. All right, well, it's been fun. See you later. Set this house on fire and your children are going to die. Huh, yeah, who pretty... could it be? <laughs> yes. Who could have done this? Goat man, I'm dancing on your bridge. It's my bridge now. Holy shit. You hear that? If you want me off this bridge, you're gonna have to kill me. Holy you're shit. You're gonna have to throw me off this bridge yourself. He did throw somebody off the bridge once. Look at the way I dance on it. I disrespect your bridge, goat man. He's taking names right now. You we, hear that, goat man? He's you, sharpening you his little blade. Nara own your bridge. Now. I don't, no, don't loot me yep. into your shit. Yep. Stop looting me. I'd hate when you do this in the Well, then places. tell him. Tell him you're not part of this. I'm not part of his little charade. You're talking to goat man now. I see what you've done. It's goat man and trapping. Goatman, I'm not with him. They're gonna put my name in graffiti. Oh my god. Okay. Children will come here and tell tales of me. We snuff these candles, so too do we snuff you from this mortal world. You fucking wimp. Jesus Christ, sir.